Today we're about to run the Law Enforcement Torch Run. It's an event that's run by the Special Olympics of New Jersey. This will be the 37th annual year that they're doing this run. Police officers all over the state of New Jersey as well as all over the world run the torch for Special Olympic athletes. Um, last year, New Jersey law enforcement raised over $4 million for the athletes of Special Olympics New Jersey. The torch goes from town to town. We're now waiting for the torch to get to the borders of Fort Lee. We'll be providing the torch with an escort down to Edgewater. I'm one of the runners, the participants for Fort Lee Police Department. I've been doing this for approximately 20 years. This puts us in a different light. We're not just police officers. We are part of a community. We care about our community and the residents of New Jersey. There's a good 21, 22,000 athletes in the state of New Jersey that all participate for free because of what we do as far as give, getting the money to them. It's important for us to show the community we're more than police officers. We do do a lot for the community. PBA Local 245 has always made it a point to be very you know, public in our events. This is my 21st year of doing uh, Special Olympics uh, fundraisers and events. It's an excellent feeling to work with these athletes and go to these events and see their smiles and to look at law enforcement and the admiration they hold towards us. Good to see the police officers out here uh, participating in the community and not just the enforcement action of the police department, but the community engagement aspect. Again, I'm very proud of the officers taking part in this leg of the Special Olympic Torch Run this year. The athletes just love law enforcement. It's another aspect to what we do, uh, another aspect to what we represent, to what we do for our community. The Fort Lee's PBA and the entire department inspires us every day, right? I mean, they have their tough jobs to do, but when they have time and they volunteer, they just do and devote their time to such worthy causes. I can't think of a more worthy cause than Special Olympics. I think it's a phenomenal program. Anyway, Fort Lee can be a part of it. We want to be a part of it. Now reach Edgewater. This is the last town on, on our uh, run for the day. We started this morning at Oakland ShopRite at 5.30 a.m. with the Oakland Police Department and winded our way through Western Bergen County to make it here to Edgewater. On behalf of 25,000 Special Olympic athletes, you guys rock. You guys are the best.